Well, there's a cracking day with winter sunshine today, and here comes a cracking boat. She's called Sunrise. We sold her a year ago, actually. She's back on the market. She's absolutely stunning. She's in mint condition. She's probably nicer now than she was a year ago, to be honest with you. She's a 57-foot trad built by Aquiline in uh, 2004. She was blacked in a year ago, October 2022. She's got 10 anodes on her. The engine was serviced in July this year, and there was a survey available from March 2020. That's available in the office for viewing. You've got solar panels on the roof there, 200 watts. Side hatch. Aquiline build lovely boats, in my opinion, and um, this one is no exception. The cratch cover there was new in May 2022, so it's only a year and a half old. The well deck is four foot six inches long, glazed cratch board, gas bottles in the forward locker there. There's two 13 kilo bottles in there. Bench seats around the edge of the well deck here with storage underneath. I want to show you inside, it's absolutely stunning. You've got um, cushions for the bench seats either side. The water tank's under my feet here, it's stainless steel, 500 litres, glazed front doors. And in we go. Feels like a country cottage. Fitted out in oak face ply and oak tongue and groove. That's a brand new click clack sofa bed. There's a 24 inch LG television here. That's 240 volts. There's a MaxView Roam Wi Fi router as well on board. Cupboard there, storage under the steps. You've got these hallmark lights in the steps, typical Aquiline. The stove is a um, more so squirrel. Solid fuel stove. Head height on the boat six foot four in the centre. All the lights are LED. And there's a breakfast bar area here with two stools. The worktops in the kitchen are uh, granite, patterned granite. The galley, oh, the saloon, by the way, was 13 feet 10 inches long, and the galley is 11 feet long. This is typical Aquiline as well. You've got these carousel storage cupboards. Three good sized drawers. Next to the four burner gas hob oven and grill. It's a new world cooker. Side hatch in the kitchen here. Shelves. There's really good use of space on this boat, actually. A little cupboard that pulls out there. The floor's wood laminate, by the way. This is a 12 volt shoreline fridge with an ice box. Cupboards above the work surface here. This frosted glass is, is another aquiline trait. You'll see some in the bathroom as well. And the sink's on this side, cupboards underneath it. Plenty of storage in the kitchen. Another cupboard here. And behind that, another pull out cupboard with a couple of poles. I don't know what you call them for tea towels, I think they are. So there we go, that's the kitchen. Absolutely beautiful. Start uh, The tongue and groove is on the so cabin sides now, and the bathroom's in here. Again, typical aquiline. So it's really nice in here. Feels like a posh hotel bathroom, to be honest. It's a ceramic sink, big mirror on the wall, covered underneath the sink here. The loo itself is a Sani Marin pump out. That was brand new in May 2022. Heated towel rail, more of the frosted glass that I mentioned here on the shower door look. Linen shelves above this little cupboard. The shower's in here. Good size shower cubicle, it's tiled. There's a light in there. Frosted glass door as well into the bathroom. There's undergunnel lighting in the corridor and the bathroom and the bedroom here. The bedroom itself is um, eight feet, six inches long. The bed is six foot by four foot ten inches. That's when it's extended. It does pull out, but you'll need an, an infill for the mattress because um, there's not one currently on the boat. Drawers underneath. Wardrobe at the head of the bed. Reading lights over. 
There's cupboards all the way along over the bed here. Another wardrobe at the foot of the bed. And more of those Hallmark Aquiline lights in the steps. There's curtains either end of the bedroom as well, actually. It's got a nice touch, that, in case there's drafts. And the engine room's here. The engine itself is an Isuzu 35 PRM 120 gearbox. There's four domestic batteries on board. 104 amp hours AGM. They were brand new in April 2022. Very neatly arranged Aquiline electrics as usual. There's one starter battery as well in the smart battery monitor. That was the inverter in there that you saw. It's a Victron Phoenix 1200 watt inverter charger. The solar charge, uh, solar charge controller was new in April 2022. There's a galvanic isolator. There's the view from the helm. Oh, such a lovely day now, but I've seen the forecast for tomorrow and it's going to be hideous again. Another walk back through. Central heating is an Eberspacher diesel fired central heating system to three radiators and a towel rail. Hot waters via the engine, the Eberspacher, or an immersion heater. That was fitted late in, in 2022, the immersion heater, so that's pretty new. Lovely bathrooms. I really love aquiline boats. Decent sized galley actually, 11 feet, I don't know if I mentioned that. Really, really lovely boat. Reluctantly leave her. There we go, so that is Sunrise. Oh, and that's a self-seeking satellite dish on the roof there, by the way. Sunrise, for further photographs, the fully downloadable colour brochure and the price, go to our website www.rugbyboats.co.uk.